engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. Uh, I have lots of favorite images from Hubble. Uh, you know, some of them because, uh, you know, they're just incredibly beautiful. Um, and some because they were the first images taken after one of the missions that I was on that proved that we fixed the Hubble and didn't break the Hubble. Um, so a after the first mission I was on in 1999, uh, the uh, Wide field camera, wide field planetary camera two took a picture called the Eskimo Nebula. Uh, and that was the first image it took after we went to the observatory. Uh, and that, you know, just was great for us to see that the thing is still working because when we got there, the Hubble wasn't taking any science at all. It had gone dark because the gyroscopes had failed. And so the prime task for that mission was to go in and put a whole new set of gyroscopes. We put in six new. Uh, gyroscopes. And these gyroscopes are what allow the Hubble to point from place to place, you know, so precisely. Uh, when you think about it, uh, one of those beautiful images, even the Hubble deep field with thousands of galaxies, is just like looking through a soda straw held at arm's length, uh, as far as how big a, a piece of the sky it looks at. So you really need to be able to point very precisely. Um, one of my favorite images is the Great Nebula in Orion. And if you go out uh, on a wintry night like tonight uh, and look up and see Orion, you can see that there's the three stars in the belt, and then there's what looks like three stars in the sword. Well, that middle star is actually not a star at all, but it's the Great Nebula in Orion, which is a region of gas and dust that's swirling around, and some of that gas and dust is collapsing, forming new stars and new solar systems, and when those stars uh, fusion turned on, they light up and illuminate that whole nebula. And that's why we can see it. And so it's a stellar nursery with hundreds of new stars and solar systems. Um, but more importantly, because Hubble sees basically in the same colors of light that we see, uh, that picture of the great nebula in Orion uh, ha has helped me anyway realize that the universe isn't just a bunch of fuzzy galaxies and points of light, uh, that it's actually a really beautiful place with all kinds of depth and richness. Um, and when you understand the science, it, it only makes it better. Um, but we, we truly live in a, in a beautiful universe and Hubble has helped show us that. 